All right, in this lesson, I'm going to be teaching you how to play the song A Whole New World from Disney's movie Aladdin. This song was recommended to me by Amy. Thank you so much for the song suggestion. Now, if anybody else has any song suggestions for me, just put them in the comment section down below, and I'd be happy to go through there and add them to the list that I use to draw from when I'm coming out with new tutorials. Now, you want to make sure to subscribe to the channel. That way, if ever I do, 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 do. No. Now, don't forget to subscribe to the channel. That way, whenever I come out with new tutorials, you'll be notified about it. Now, let's go ahead and get started with today's lesson. I can show you the world Shining, shimmering, splendid Tell me, princess, now when did you last let your heart decide? I can open your eyes, take you wonder by wonder, over sideways and under on a magic carpet ride. A whole new world, a new fantastic point of no one to tell us no or where to go I say we're only dreaming a whole new world A dazzling place I never knew But when I'm way up here It's crystal clear that now I'm in a whole Signs, indescribable feelings, soaring, tumbling, freewheeling through an endless diamond sky, a whole new world, a hundred thousand things to see. I'm like a shooting star, I've come so far. Can't go back to where I used to be With new horizons to pursue I'll chase them anywhere There's time to spare Let me share this whole new world with you A whole new world That's where we'll be Thrilling chase, a wondrous place for you and me. All right, now I'm playing this song with the C chord family with my capo here on the second fret. So I'm actually playing in the key of D. Now a lot of the chords in this song are moving pretty fast. So if you want, take the song, slow it down. I'm playing it right now at 120 beats per minute. But you can take that and drop it down significantly uh, just for practice. You know, you won't be able to sing along with it when you drop it down too much, but at least it'll help you to practice those chord transitions. Uh, and as you practice them, you'll get faster and faster. And then you can speed up the beats per minute as you go. All right, now this song has four beats per measure, but many of the chords are only lasting for half of a measure. Usually chords will at least last for one measure, but some of these are only lasting for half of a measure, which means you have to switch chords mid strum okay in the middle of your strumming pattern which can you know create a little bit of difficulty if you're just learning the strum pattern so i want to go over this with you uh, one of the parts you know at the very beginning of the song we're going from c then we're going to a minor 7 and g now the a minor 7 and g are both only lasting half of measure the a minor 7 lasts for beat 1 and 2 of the measure and the G lasts for beat three and four of the measure, okay? Remember, the measure is four beats total. So one, two, three, four, okay? And we're using the folk pattern, which for the folk pattern, we have down, 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 up, down, up, like that. So it's one, two, three, and four, and, okay? So when we're playing the A minor seven for only two beats, for beats one and two, it's gonna be one, two and then we switch to the g three and four and and then we're back on the new chord which i believe after that is the d minor okay so again it's one two three and four and and then you're on a new measure okay 
so you slow it down even to that level. You know, when you're when you're just practicing trying to get these half, you know, these half uh, half measure chords, when you're trying to understand them, break it down really slow, and just practice it so you can get your mind wrapped around the idea, and then you can start to speed it up. All right, if you'd like to get the chord chart for this song, just click on the link right here and that'll take you on over to the website where you can download the chord chart for this song and many others. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel and I look forward to seeing you in the next lesson. Take care.